for Hayes to the net. Score! Comes to Hayes. He scores! Great shot by Kevin Hayes. Uh, I spent 22 years in Boston before I came here, and uh, I actually don't think I ever came here while I was in Boston. And I didn't really like anyone from New York growing up, and uh, that changed uh, the minute I got here. Uh, I mean, it's, it's an amazing city. Uh, the things that this city has to offer is uh, top notch and unlike any other city, basically in the whole entire world. And uh, I've completely fell in love with this city and uh, it is a place that I like to call home. But the best part is just being able to walk around the city. When I leave my apartment, I can walk for miles and there's something, you can basically do something memorable every single day, whether it's going to a, an important, like a famous statue or a park or heading out to some museums, going down to 9-11 Memorial. It's, uh, it's, pretty, it's pretty cool to, to wake up and be able to walk outside and do something interesting every day. My first three years, I lived alone. Uh, and then last year, Brady and Jimmy were rookies and they, uh, they got an apartment together and uh, we'd all leave the rink and end up at each other's apartment. So we actually found uh, a pretty cool apartment in Tribeca where all three of us can kind of live together and be separated within the apartment. So it's been working out so far. Yeah, my fashion, fashion sense has changed 100%. Uh, in Boston and at Boston College, I wore uh, sweatpants and a hoodie pretty much every single day. And uh, I learned quickly uh, here just hanging out with the Rangers, like guys like Henrik, and then I've actually ch changed my wardrobe completely. So I, uh, I try to look presentable every day and look professional every day, and, and uh, sweatpants and hoodie are kind of an after 10 p.m. thought now. I just think how much history has been in the building. I think us as players know that, and I think people that come to Madison Square Garden and people that are fans of the Rangers realize how how insane of a building this this, uh, this Madison Square Garden really is, and um, I mean they're very faithful fans. They uh, they're there when you're winning, and they they let you know when you're losing as well, which is a good thing and what we need. And uh, I wouldn't want to play in front of anyone else.